the celebrity guests have arrived i'm going to tell you guys how the reaction was up to this moment someone has had sex in the house i don't even know if this week was their first time people are actually getting a bit paranoid right now we're going to talk about that as well another thing i'm going to talk about today is toyo everybody gives you advice yeah on how to live your life how to live your life Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So right now I'm going to give you a quick recap on everything that has happened up to this evening But I gave everyone a task to write a poem. So while they were in the room, Shea Atacha did just justing about everything As I told you guys in the last episode and then Shea was like, uh, okay, when they come to the house What should they even tell the housemates they were doing? And he said something like we should just tell them that the both of them went to Abuja Because Buhari really liked them as housemates and sent for them to come and that was really funny I put it on Twitter and I got like <laughs> over hundreds of retweets on that tweet so I thought that was really funny I wish he actually did it but I don't know if they're supposed to perform the poem this evening but I just want to quickly do this recap because the most important thing today has happened let's talk about the house so Ike and Mercy have been getting along so well like it's so cool this morning they were just lying on the bed Ike was just asking her questions he even asked her okay what did you even read in school I've not even asked you she said psychology like oh, so you're studying me you're studying me he asked her about what her sister read her sister's names her brother I think she mentioned her brother stammered like he just really genuinely wanted to know about the girl because clearly he's falling like she just seen his eyes just on the bed and she's just explaining explaining herself and yeah she also talked about her first boyfriend he was eternal staying downstairs in their house and then she was really young obviously nobody knew she was dating the guy but the guy used to like sleep with girls because she wasn't giving him sex that like, he was bring secondary school girls to the house like that was just disgusting anyway she also talked about the music the guy used to play that once the girls come you just play this music and everyone knew yes there are guys in the house but she wants to call his name obviously because her said her brother will kill her Okay, when I mentioned in the intro that people had had sex in the house, I meant Kathy and Gedoni. So apparently they've done this before, but I'm not sure. I only talk about, you know, the one I had seen. Monday or Tuesday night, can't remember again. Yeah, it was actually like proper home pain, like, you know, that home that, except they were just feeling each other. I don't know, but it looked really. I'm really hoping um, Kathy's heart doesn't get broken, to be honest. The only hope I have for her is that Gedoni is 31, according to the blogs and the profile when they came in. And Kathy is 20. Does she look 20? I don't know, but, you know, that age gap. So I'm just hoping it's a bit mature enough to handle it properly because I don't know anything in that house especially after there was that whole Kim drama I'm really really hopeful for Kathy you know that she doesn't get her broken they did truth or dare that night as well Esther I think kissed Freud a bit just mm, and then um, Nelson as well and then she gave Freud a lap dance they asked uh, <laughs> Toya did an interview with the, the Delfinator TV she always does interviews when these people go out so if you want to see the whole thing go to her channel and watch it interview he talked about Diane Street or it's the old half an hour to eat the confirmed check you but with small edo blood half an hour and dinner. Who were the best cooks? Ella was the best cook. That chaka cook half an hour was on point. Who did you say was the best cook? No, I can't. I can't. But there are some people like Jackie that weren't cooking. But Jackie was just to eat. <laughs> and you just to bring plate and just eat. Right. Let's talk about Diane. I won't say I like Diane. I like Diane as a person. I like a personality. But I told her that I have a girlfriend outside though. Mm. When you say anything that happened, how do you think your girlfriend will feel hearing that? Uh, she knows that I killed the whole sinner. She wants to understand. Wow. I, I told her before coming to the show that I'm going to the show. I'm not expecting any kind of relationship or trying to have emotions. Mm -hmm. But if it happens, just take it and see if it happens because it's not easy to be in the house. Just there are rumors that people have gone beyond first and second base sexual intercourse in the house already. Mm -hmm. But they can't dance on Saturday nights. I don't understand. Some people like private things. I like doing it on right. that day. You guys talk about Mercy and Ike. Lamborghini Mercy. Okay, Lamborghini Mercy. Yo. <laughs> They're so thirsty. What happened there? First of all, Mercy has been wanting to me to dance with her very well. Really? Did she tell you that? She told me or? that she wanted to take her legs around my neck before the party. And I'm like, okay, no, Allah, like, we can do this now. Right, so you even planned it. He told me, I'm like, no, I'm, like, I'm, free. I'm not a stingy person. You ask me, I give you something. He said he's not stingy. I'm not stingy you know? <laughs> I'm a cheerful giver, depending on the kind of thing you're asking me for. Yeah, I've been mean, dance with Diane, dance with Esther. Yeah, I was keeping messy for the last mm. So I can enjoy myself very well. Look at <laughs> See how he's smiling. So, um, we're dancing. I think, I think I saw Ike obsessed, a bit of, um, upset. Tell me to like, how far. And he was pushing me, so I'm like, oh, what's wrong with this guy? I said, I think I knew for Mike that I'm thinking Mike and Kathy there because I was dancing with Mercy. Mm. And I'm like, not put the ring on her finger. Exactly. You are not dating. That's if you are saying that ah, this is my girlfriend in the house. So. 
We came here for people that should go and have fun. You can't be telling me that I can't trust anybody. Else. Yeah, but you but you'd seen over time that they were always together. They seem to have coupled up already. I think everybody kind of got that, you know. So imagine she wanted that to see me and I tell her I'm like, oh, that's you too. Yeah, because you're a Nikki. Because you're Nikki, so like, I have a problem. Let's but did you guys have a talk after that? Mommy and Ike. You guys iron it out. Yeah, yeah, Ike came up and I apologized as a real woman, which I respect. Yeah, as, like, as a real woman. Yeah, that's what, that's what real men do. So he came out like he's sorry that he was upset at Mercy, but he took it out on me. Mm. Like um, Sardi, or Marshala, tell him we're Mercy. Like for them to be the first one to speak when I was meet. Jeff and I. She, with Jackie, we never bonded at all. Mike is, I think he grew up, I don't know, I think UK or I don't know. Mm -hmm. Well, he has street orientation. Come you know, you know, see. Ella said the same thing that there's something, there's a, like, not Ella, was it Kim? And there's like a rough there's, background there's somewhere. There's something that you have to do, but he doesn't want to bring it out. It's mm. different from Mindy, I don't know, cool, I'm cool, novice, but he's a bad guy. He needs to explain his name very, very well. So when Ibuka showed him his time in the house, showed him people that nominated him for those one of you, I was like, he thought, uh uh, we were cool. That's it for Toya, let's now go into today. So we put that to the housemates, they were going to expect guests. We realized I didn't hear when he read it to them, but obviously I followed the Twitter account very much. So on the account, it was obviously that like people that had told them they were going to expect celebrity guests they should dress up you know have their you know, clean the house you know do everything i saw um Kathy saying oh my god this house has never been as clean as this like see to even have all this space in this house like they literally cleaned the house they cooked got their presentation ready they bathed up like i ek wore a you know nice casual fitted suit. i'm sure he's even angry because that boy's bath is already finished he said he has only two weeks worth of baths left and he doesn't like repeating ah, messing up gave them one shared dress that was like high low to the side looking sexy af mike was just calm someone that wore suits to his audition i thought he was going to wear it again but no he just wore a shirt and you know just again as everyone's looking clean even the casual ones were looking fine see the girls and their lashes like umbrella canopy on their eyes waiting for celebrity guests i wonder who do you expect maybe two faces but they cut up ready the door now open touch and i <laughs> like this Oh, but you know, so she you were the jobs. Even me, I was so happy, guys. For some reason, I'm just happy. They've come back home and everything, but ah, it was clear. Mercy's face was not even understanding what was happening. Mike was looking all right. He was happy. Obviously, she was there. He was really touched at the inside. Oh, but these people would have been doing like this clearly. But she just made the vibrancy, just plus just seeing touch at the shock, fear, different kind of reactions. But pain was in most people's hearts to be honest like people like Messi was in their face Diane was just by Messi like in the misery Jackie obviously was just for me hugging Shay like her father went somewhere Esther ha Esther was not even as in <laughs> anyway they shared the hug 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 then I said okay come and sit down um Mike even asked um, I think that's the only chair available it's not like he actually wanted to just go and sit down beside her Sat, could he sit here? She said, yes, yeah, she sat there, she did everything, and then he said he was going to say the grace. He said everyone should hold their hands, so he was holding Tacha's hand, and then he was really hoping, like, at least everything would melt and just go. All that. You know, they had a whole huge fight that she even put something on his body before he left, so... Nisha now um, said, okay, so he now carried his paper and said reading a speech to all the housemates. He, like, gave each of them a paragraph, like, two or three sentences about everybody. Very nice description. The only person he said something come out about was Jeff. He said nice things about Japan was like you can be less manipulative that was the only person he said something Tacha was like okay okay it's okay she is my turn it's my turn she just carried her papers and Tacha was just like three three lines per person she started with Esther ended with Jackie I don't know if she's that creative enough to have made that so intentional but the first and the last statements were the horrible <laughs> the first thing she said was so you guys from the bottom of my heart I really missed everybody I just did like this so she now said, Esther, uh, Esther, uh, okay, it's my name first. She said, you are strong. She just clicked a small smile. Mm. I least expected. <laughs> Jesus. I was just like, <laughs> my heart. Like, how'd you say that? She now she went around and around. This person, that person. She said, this one was nice. Ike's one was okay. Like, and she said, mercy, you're lovable. And she said something really nice. About I was so happy. In the end, it was now Jackie. You are you. Like, who says that? Anyway, when they finished, I think everyone wants to start doing another speech again, which was exhausting. Are you guys not tired of talking too much? Mike, you know, went on and on about she, and that was fine. And then he said, touch her. Dread. I'm going to keep it 100. In fact, I have the audio. <laughs> so maybe I should play what Mike said. Tasha, before you left, um, I'm just going to keep it 100. I'm not going to lie. I did not like your energy. 
all in all, I thought Mike was so real with what he said because he just said it the way he is. Like he wasn't, he was kind of elated when she left. Even when he came now, he was just like, but he just gave a little advice. Just try and, because this, your attitude is against you. Forget, even if you win people that house, I mean, I'm the one adding my own. You get like, even if you win people that house, whatever, like all these. So why she was not talking, why he was still talking? Tatcha just said, well, me, I'm here to the 99th day. <laughs> Again, okay, we don't kill me for my mother. Anyway, I was just like, God, this girl, can you just keep quiet? You know, you're still here, like, you're still here, boss lady. For the fact that they dressed up to even welcome you, celebrity, like, she just left it like that. We well, you know, her is Tatcha, like, she doesn't even think too much about what anybody's thinking, she just does her. And then Amashila now came in his own speech saying, We missed you guys. When I saw you guys coming in, I felt so much joy. I said, How much like you are on your own? Like, nobody is feeling any joy here for Tatcha. Maybe, maybe for she, but. And when he finished, immediately Mercy and Esther just went into the room. That hey, how can I'm shall be saying that? That please, this, 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 we're not too much. That you know, Mercy now said it's a game. We're now like, well, how can someone go to a, you're in a game with someone competing? The person now comes back, big brother, big brother, partial, you're partial. Like, please calm down. She and Tatcha got the highest votes this week. <laughs> Some people were now comparing the situation when Chloe came back, how the reaction was, blah, blah, blah. The reaction would have been different because the girl got the lowest vote. She was actually evicted, sent home, sat, sat, sat on home for two weeks, came with outside information. So it's different. Tatcha was not. She was not. The fact that you don't like her doesn't mean she's out of the game and you still have competition. Deal with it. So yeah, they were really angry with her. So while Esther and Mercy were talking in the room, Jeff now came back. When they leave, that they obviously leave now. And Esther now said, no, did you hear when Tatcha said she's yet in 99th day? As in, just by their guests, like real celebrity guests, Joker. He's even lucky he wasn't because Jeff was so up this week. Anyway, you guys saw that video. <laughs> Ike and Messina went to the garden to be talking. Rest the day, we are really not happy. So they now, Amashina now came and Messina, like, are you really saying the truth that you, you, you're happy that he came? Amashina, yes, that forget all these people that, that to him, that he's even here as a blessing already, that you know, he can't be doing one day in the end. All these cockles with people are happy. There's only one of you that's going to go with the money. So if you like, die here, scream here. Messina, like, yeah, she can't wait for the top five, top five. But to me, the advice I'll give them is just enjoy your process. You get this is Big Brother's house, Big Brother's roof. Like watch Big Brother Africa since 1998 till today. Whatever Big Brother is going to do, he's going to do. Like there was a time where they were evicting two, two people last year. Before they came to that Alex and they, they brought only one person. You get so things like that will happen. You cannot come and kill yourself. You just utilize your time well. Then anyway, I shouldn't be advising you guys because you guys are not in the house. But yeah, that's my own thoughts on that. So that was how we, I stopped watching right now. Um, Gidoni is just hugging Kafi. Sadi has come to to hug, <laughs> hug three of them. I think everybody's kind of like mixed emotions now and stuff. Guys, so while I was editing now, Tatcha had called Mike outside for them to have a talk. But it was Mike doing the talking, like he was just trying to clear the air, seeing where he was coming from, his advice he gave. He talked to lot, yeah. And then she just made a few comments, but clearly they're in a good place right now. They had a conversation in the kitchen with Shei and all that. So I'll just put a little clip of it and then we'll end this video. The general vibe that you get, you're all here lesser than me. And Mike also made reference to the title of, I think it was my second BBN video, when I asked if Tatcha was arrogant or confident. Confidence and his arrogance. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all for all the support you've been giving in my videos. Please click the like button and follow me on Twitter. I'm quite active on Twitter. I'm actually <laughs> BB Niger active on Twitter. Like, it's surprising. Subscribe if you haven't and see you on the next episode. Bye bye. Everybody gives you advice, yeah, on how to live your life, how to live